going to talk about any rectangular light characters. Uh, I'll check, explain uh, their film. Uh, uh, what I would like to do is I'll just bring in here. So we're going to bring in uh, here. And there she is. But what I want to do is just right now, it doesn't matter of an animation. The goal is the lighting, uh, the way we put it. And as you see, it's pretty flat, right? Not anything extra. What I'm going to do is bring in an angular light and I can which direction the light is. And I can this around and you double U key. I can move it and see right away. I have this light for character. So one of the th also doing in this, I already know where I'm going to plan on characters. I'm going to have one there, one here. And I'm going to have here, and I was happy with the lighting over here. So what you want to do up your lighting, you do your next scene. Uh, you should start making the decision of what you want your characters to be based on organize your environment. And so I already know I have a character going there, one character going there, duplicates of some of the characters going in here. So all of that works in the next video. But really, it does really make a nice look at this if we zoom in here. How much nicer the characters if I, and if you want to check what it looks like when you talk, just hit the little eyeball out and look at that like you difference you know and one of the you can do while you're doing your clip is move around to see how the lighting's in camera we can do that during our previs all right so that's how you're the lighting